Hi, my name is Adam Davis, and I'm on the board of directors of the National Mitigation Banking Association. When I started on the board about a year and a half ago, um, my first priority was to start reaching out to the nonprofit organizations that have conservation and restoration missions that are similar to the goals of the NMBA. Um, for a long time, we've been arguing for good compensatory mitigation policy in Washington. Um, and I know that there are organizations out there that have a similar agenda. Um, and I wanted to amplify the number of voices that are carrying these messages to important policymakers in Washington. So um, I reached out to the Environmental Defense Fund and the Nature Conservancy, and later to Defenders of Wildlife. And all three of those groups have been very active with us for the past year and a half or so in developing our positions and our thinking on um, important issues uh, around compensatory mitigation. So the primary thing we've worked on is um, uh, the development of the new mitigation policy uh, in the Fish and Wildlife Service mm -hmm. um, and the rewriting of the 2003 conservation banking guidance. So basically, uh, our, my hope was that we would be able to learn from the development of the 2008 rule uh, in the Clean Water Act and take really the object lessons and principles from that into regulation of mitigation under the Endangered Species Act. And it's been a very dynamic conversation with the partners and a very constructive one. We developed a joint set of principles, have gone to meetings with Fish and Wildlife together, both the uh, mitigation banking community and the nonprofits. And uh, while we don't agree on everything, mm -hmm. um, we have a strong overlap of, I'd say, 90% of the things that we're uh, trying to do uh, are things that they're in favor of, and we're, we're in good conversation about the other 10%. So it's been a very productive conversation, and um, uh, I'm thrilled to say that both the Nature Conservancy and the Environmental Defense Fund have actually joined NMBA as members, and Will McDowell from the Environmental Defense Fund has just joined on the board of the NMBA. Uh, as of yesterday. So great. we're making great progress and really appreciate the involvement of the nonprofit community in these issues.